Okay, so good morning, afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm in a bathroom right now because I'm at my buddy's place, so we're watching Money in the Bank. You can also watch Money in the Bank on our live stream. But yes, I cover every single Winnipeg Jets news, and being out of the house will not stop me for that. The Winnipeg Jets have re-signed Vladislav Nemesnikov for two years at two million dollars. I really like this signing. I I I can't I can't stress that enough. Vladislav Nemestikov is a great top nine player who can play on the wing and in center. He plays fluid with the top six. He would, had a lot of great chemistry with Nikolai Ehlers in the limited time that he got to play. He's a guy who can play on the power play. He played a little on the penalty kill, but he doesn't play much. He mostly plays on the power play on a second unit, which dad, badly needs firepower and could probably be making it on the first unit this year. I just like this move. I think... He's been looking for a home, and Winnipeg has offered him a home. He's been with, like, eight teams in the past eight years. It's been a long road for Vlaslav Nemestikov, and I am happy that he is staying. I think that moving forward, we're going to have to see which RFAs we're coming back for what the contract term is. Jets have around 13 to $14 million in cap. Now that gets shredded down by 2 mil, but it is a welcome sign to see this move being made by the Winnipeg Jets, who I was worried was going to fall asleep and do nothing. So far, we've got Colin Dila and we've re-signed Vladislav Nemeskov. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Sorry for the decor. I just have to cover this somewhere. Thank you so much. We'll see you next time.